So in this video, I'm going to show you how to stuff a wiffle ball with crinkle paper. Um, what I do is I use this. It is a um, pair of like jewelry pliers. Um, it cuts the wire, flattens it, and then has the needle nose uh, points. I got this from Walmart couple years ago I would say it's anywhere from like three to six dollars so pretty cheap this is a small golf ball sized wiffle ball and then whatever crinkle paper you have so what you're gonna do is just start with whatever amount and then at the ends you're gonna want to twist and then fold it over twist some more and then flatten it and then take your wiffle ball and put it in one of the holes and then I use these to kind of stuff it in there and make sure that it goes in as far as it can and you can see I don't push it through all the way just like a quarter just so it's sticking out enough do it a couple more times here tornado sirens going on Fold it in half, twist the end to a point, kind of flatten it, and then stick it in there. And then use the tips. So just kind of push it in there, give it some support so they can still tug it out, but it won't completely, it won't all come out with one pull. Because so I know the Valentine's Day one I made, he's been pulling on it for a while and it's still, he gets a little bit out every day, but he hasn't been able to pull it all out, so. Do one more here. I don't know if you guys can hear that. It's just so eerie. I hate the way tornado sirens sound. Okay, so just gather the crinkle paper and fold it in half. Kind of flatten it, twist it to a point. Like that. Put it in the wiffle ball. And then use the jewelry pliers. And a pair of just regular needle nose pliers will work as well. I don't know if they're more expensive or less expensive. But I imagine you can find a relatively cheap pair just to do some uh, crafts with. But there you are, just keep going till the whole thing is full and then you'll have a crinkle stuffed wiffle ball.